I'm trying to understand this game. I really am. Well, I mean, like, what do you want me to do? Like, to protect my teammate or the fucking vehicle? Uh, it's a little bit of both. That's it, this... thing. Okay, and I'm learning this. This is the second time I've played it. So, I'm not, I'm um, not sure. I'm like, what to do here? And so you're not buying me back, you're buying the vehicle back, right? The turn is gonna buy yeah. everyone back. You're sure, I understand this. But like, it that doesn't make sense, uh, you know, like I'm used to race. What up YouTube? So great to see you guys. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. And as you can tell from the intro, my boy is hella confused on what is going on with this new Armored Royale 2.0 limited time game mode that we are having. So this is a deep dive guide on the full game mode on what to do, tips and tricks, more on that after the intro. Let's get right into it. You look beautiful. All right, guys, I truly do hope you enjoy this video. And if you like what you see, you know what to do. You know what to click. You know where to find me. So let's get into this new Armored Royale 2.0. Uh, it's an uh, old school Verdansk edition that they had where they would start two trucks at, at two, uh, two berthas at one spot. And you'd have to advance and fight your way to, to advance to the next spot and to the next spot until you reach your destination. But this one is a full-on total BR mode of that version on steroids. All right, there's three things you have to do. You have to defend your NRAP, you have to upgrade your NRAP, and you have to outrun the gas. Okay, when you defend your NRAP, your squad will respond as long as your NRAP it hasn't been destroyed. If your vehicle has too much damage, head to the nearest gas station to fix it up. Okay, guys? Uh, upgrade your MRAP. You want to use the rear-mounted buy station on your NRAP to buy upgrades. In this station, your vehicle... Uh, in an event your vehicle is destroyed, head to any buy station to buy a replacement. Okay, guys? You want to outrun the gas as fast as you can. The gas shrinks rapidly and fast, and you can never judge it. So, you want to stay in your vehicle in order to outrun it as fast as possible. And as soon as you land, I highly recommend you and your squad loot up as fast as you can trying to get five thousand five hundred dollars to get the 22k you're going to need to make all purchases upgrades in the nrap once you do have enough cash you head to the rear upgrade station of your nrap and there you have access to uh, two parts of the buy station first is going to be the mrap equipment there you can repair your truck it's unlimited and after you can repair your truck you can buy loadout markers that's unlimited unlimited ammunitions unlimited gas masks and unlimited uh, armor boxes and the second one the most important one is the upgrade and wrap upgrades the UAVs the trophy systems the barrel upgrades the heavy armor the grenade turret and the smokes and also the engine, which is also most important. So your NRAP is also moves as fast as it can with that heavy armor. It slows you down a little bit too. Uh, once you're, um, you make the purchases or your teammate makes purchases, like how it's showing up top, it'll show you the purchases it does make. And also on the very bottom below uh, your teammate's name, it gives you icons. Uh, let's talk about your backpack real quick though. Uh, I'd highly recommend looting for gas masks. If not looting for them, buying for them off your NRAP. Um, there's tons of redeploy flares too so highly recommend keeping redeploy flares extra ammunition especially rockets so before we even load in let's talk about our loadouts okay i've been running the iso hemlock because it's just been feeling good especially with these uh range these gunfights that we've been having um, here's the loadout if you want to check that out uh, but just the distances between these gunfights we've been having the ISO has been doing really really good work and also I've been carrying a Joker Javelin and with this loadout has been very deadly and very successful too because you can fight the NRAPs and you can also fight your enemies And honestly, if you ask me, this is how the MROP should have came a long time ago since it's first been introduced to the game. It should have had a buy station coming with it. It should have had everything uh, enabled to, for you to 
upgrade your MRAP, buy loadouts, buy gas masks, everything that it comes with it, as you've seen it just right now. Um, but still, I guess better late than never. And um, this game mode is crazy because you think you're chasing one team and another team pulls up right behind you and just automatically downs you and then your whole squad's in scrambles. Um, luckily, they did not kill our MRAP and my boy Warfare was able to fix it during all this craziness. Uh, I popped smokes immediately and I decided to get in the MRAP and just get it out of there as fast as possible. Maybe even take it to a gas station to get it fixed up, get it fueled up, get it ready for the next thing. My tires are popped, and once your back tires especially, you lose a lot of traction, you lose your speed. So I was trying to repair the back tire, and I get caught up between the menu and the back tire repair, and I got sniped. And that's when uh, Warfare was able to use a buyback flare, or a re uh, reinforcement flare, to get me back right into the game. Uh, these flares are super clutch, and I'm glad that they have it in this game mode. As soon as I died right there, he popped his flare so I didn't have to wait, down, uh, wait for the countdown to go down. And I can get right into the spot. Because if not, you would have to wait for the countdown in order to redeploy back in uh, to your squad. And it's like a flare that pops up from your MRAP. That, that it's almost like from the buy station on your MRAP, excuse me. And if, uh, like you said, if your MRAP is destroyed, you can head to any buy station and purchase a new buy, uh, new MRAP. It's just like any other thing. You, you hold down your, 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 um, your equipment and it'll throw it out there. And a... A uh, big plane will come drop it out of the sky. Uh, I, I like it. I like the cinematography, man. I honestly love the cinematography that Call of Duty puts into the game. And I wish they just did more of it. I wish they had more character animation. Just more things that were more... Just get more submersive. This gets you more involved into the game. Okay, so, highly recommend, if you have the money to buy your NRAP and you are the last player alive, buy the NRAP, because in return, it will buy all your teammates back. It's not immediate, okay? It doesn't happen right away. It does take a while. So, as you just saw, I bought the NRAP probably about 30 seconds in, and 30 seconds in is when it redeployed my first teammate in, okay? Probably after that, it goes down to, I'd say, 10 seconds uh, your next uh, your next teammate route deploy and another 10 more seconds uh, your last and fourth teammate route deploy bringing your whole squad back in um, during the whole chaos your loadouts do drop but it drops during the second collapse so it takes a while okay you can't be waiting on it otherwise uh, you'll you'll get you'll definitely get ran up on just like how I did right now trying to wait for my squad to redeploy and man the the team damaged me and they took out my tires and they destroyed my end wrap. I just try to get away. I get away, I get away. And to get away to the storm, okay? The storm closes rapid. It's fast. It is quick. It is on your heels. It is relentless. It'll take your life without even thinking about it, okay? So plan accordingly. And the limited amount of gas stations that are involved in the store, dude, makes it even harder for you to plan accordingly because you want to hit up a gas station to not only refuel if you don't have a gas canister. Because uh, inside these things, right on top of the roof right there, is a gas canister. If none of your teammates pick it up and you're in the, not in the seat next to it, you can't equip the gas canister. And you have to stop at these buy stations. And, and it's just very risky because a lot of people are already there camping it and doing the same thing. Either refueling or camping the buy station so they can get ready to outrun the next storm. So just be careful. Think about it. Plan ahead. Rotate ahead. Rotate early. And uh, you should be fine. And once you do have your NRAP, you must keep looting for more cash so you can buy your loadout and get get yourself into the game because without your guns it's kind of hard um, again you can rotate to the free loadout just like how warfare and i are doing right here and again big shout out to warfare that's always down to rock with these uh these cool game plays you'll be seeing a lot of him a lot of these cool uh limited time game modes that they wish they'd bring back um he is always down he's definitely my dmz fucking dog too for sure uh so big shout out to him uh asparagus was back in the mix too so thanks for asparagus for being completely lost and um oblivious to this game mode because you know, he's, he's a veteran. He's an OG, dude. And he's fucking definitely one of the sharpest nails in the tool shed. So if he didn't understand the game mode, then there's going to be a lot of people that did not understand it, just like how he did. But um, 
right off the bat, Warfare and I did, and uh, we had a blast. Uh, the game mode you're going to be seeing right here is me and him, uh, our two other teammates, backed out. So again, sure enough, it just comes down to me and him, two versus four, uh, and pretty much just dominating the lobby. Dude. Like, uh, I, I could definitely rely on this cat, too, and he's always down to take the punches, too. Super cool fucking kid, and got a good head on the shoulder, so I'm glad he's uh, on the fucking team and shit. And uh, once we can get a solid third, we'll be dominating the fucking ring and all this other shit, too. And I'm, I'm pretty sure we're going to have a great time in one of the three as well. But just look at this Joker putting in hard work, dude. It, you, If you're a squad of two, you, you have to rotate between driving, managing the turret, upgrading your MRAP, and also using your, your loadout effectively. You know, I was able to use the Javelin, the Joker, effectively as well as use my uh, ISO to knock other players um, and yeah so thank you so much for clicking on the video you guys um, I'm gonna get out of here I'm gonna leave you to the rest of this gameplay it's super sick dude me and Warfare dominated and we stayed alive all the way to the last round uh, thank you so much for clicking on the video you look amazing hope you have a great day hope you have a great month hope you have a great year my name's Sincere and I'll catch you guys in the next video Peace, 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 peace. Love you.
Oh, uh, we can buy another vehicle at a buy station. Yeah. For like six grand. Love it, love it. Do you think if we rotate early, we can just get to a buy station? Like one over here and then, uh, Fortress? Or where? Uh, back in the observatory. Worst cover ever. Seconds. I have smokes though. Oh, shit. Wow. Yes. Okay, look at that big move. Yeah, not for quite your face. God damn it. Uh deploy trophy. I want trophy. Trophy's way too close not to get. All of them, like yeah dude, for real, there's some things that are just like OP. And that's what I was talking Bombs about. Bombs best. I wish, I wish they would have done that. Why well, is the vehicle, dude? Oh, someone. Vest at least shows me where they're pointing to and if they're near oh, our yeah, level yeah, yeah. like fuck yeah I'll take that shit I can, uh... Almost, you can, yeah. You can get the last upgrade now. Come on. Got the vehicle, dude.
that goes down below. Took out their shit. Yep, but there's still four. Just run back and break that one. Oh, Up, right? <laughs> Probably got a trophy system too.
6k. Because if you buy the vehicle, it gets me back too. Uh, uh, uh. Good try. Yeah. It was very difficult with fucking nobody. Just you and me. <laughs>